Hello everyone, myself Ravi. Welcome to my channel. In today's video, I will create how to create a dynamic tabs by using bootstrap classes. Those who are watching my video for the first time, for them my suggestion is to watch, watch my bootstrap playlist so that they can set up the bootstrap. In that playlist, I created the web page like this. In that web page, I created the pop-up and navigation bar and photo sliding slideshow and news scrolling one by one and multiple images sliding and displaying date and time these are the content i covered in my playlist now in this video i will create one dynamic web page web page suppose save as now i am writing the file name as tab inside the tab I am removing entire, entire body content now my body is blank and I am titled my dynamic tab this is the title and these are the links and script I already covered in my first video this is the setup how to set up the bootstrap so please watch before watching this video now I write a tab tab now see friends my dynamic tab in the body section nothing is there entirely it is blank now start writing the code first I will take the container division write container and close the container inside the container I want to work in a 8 grid system 8 grid suppose div class equal to CYLM small screen 8 in 8 grid I want my dynamic tab should be appeared this is the 8 grid inside the 8 grid I am giving the heading like suppose download section anything you can give the heading download section Now see friends how the page is appearing. Oh, my download section was appeared in front of me. Now I want to create the list items. For that, write unordered list. Closing the unordered list. After the unordered list, I am creating three tabs. List, name it as first forms first tab name is similarly second tab I want to write drivers drivers in third tab I will write softwares simple HTML code I have written an order list with three list types difference now it is appearing like this but I want in a tab manner for that you have to give a class for the unordered list class equal to navigate now now I find tabs this is the class now see now it is appeared in single line tab but we need some spacing for the spacing don't worry just give the anchor tag a data toggle that is the attribute name name is tab 
after that give the hyper reference to some hash form and close this and after the forms close the anchor tag like this copy to both the drivers and softwares and name the name it with whatever you like drive soft like this I given the name and closing of anchor tag and closing of Now see friends how beautiful it is appearing. But by default any one of my tab should be is in active mode. So that it appears. For that suppose I want my forms. By default it will be active. I will write active. So friends now it is by default it is it is in active by clicking this it is a bit in black by clicking this it is a bit in black if you don't want this type of design you can change the class of tabs to pins now it is appearing like in pills manner this is the piece. Now start writing the tab content. Below the unordered list, below the unordered list, first of write the div class equal to tab content. Tab content. And closing my division inside this division we have to write for division uh, some heading h3 uh, this is forms uh, download section this is form download section and closing my h3 this is the first division i'm copying this paste this again paste this second division is for drivers third is for softwares the three sections now now I didn't appear any classes simply I write HTML code now see how it is appearing all the three are in single tab but we don't want like that forms is in forms driver should be is in drivers and software is in software for that we have to write the class name for ID equal to here we have created form uh, h reference form so mention id with form okay name it form and class equal to tab pan fade by default one should be is inactive inactive like this you have to write simply copy this content and apply for other two and change the id name drive for the second one third one 
soft but one should be is inactive so remove this both the inactive now save it and refresh see how the major change now see friends if i click by default forms are opened and forms download section appeared in front of me if i click drivers then driver section is appearing if i click softwares the software section is opening like this in this video itself i will show you how the listing should be created listing of groups it is very simple inside the forms download section i am creating an order list and i am closing the an order list inside the an order list li forms some general forms and closing of list items now see how it is appearing now inside the forms section my general forms was created but it is in plain i want it in a box list box like this for that i have to add some class that is for the unordered list that is list group and for the li list this is the list group item in that group this is one of the item list group item similarly you can copy it some more see friends now it is appearing in big box and with the list naming and you can assign the colors also list group some success success means light green color will appear control c paste paste here renaming success to danger then red color will be appeared and some info light blue color will appear like this you can list our content list group item i forgot to write item list group item success list group item danger list group item info see friends how beautiful it is appearing in the forms we write we created three list item terms like this in driver section similar passionly you can create another i will copy paste simply an order list to copy paste software section also paste here remove some hp drivers whatever it is like like this right and softwares right bootstrap no save by default forms is in active it is opening if i click drivers then click see hp drivers if i click softwares bootstrap is appeared 
the three list group items are appearing in, in dynamically it is appearing in single page itself but it is appearing in dynamically this is the favorite video for those who are in web developing for them it is very useful thanking you friends if it is useful to you please like me and subscribe me for my for channel it will give you some in boost up for, so that i can make more some more videos thanking you